How do you like your speakers? Unobtrusive, blending into the background but delivering fantastic sound? How about a statement piece that you can make the focal point of your living room but that still delivers a great 360 degree sound? The Trichitra Trisan 1 is a beautifully crafted conical speaker that will look at home in your living room, kitchen or any office complete with a unique three-way speaker design to ensure a balanced listening experience. The Trisan 1 is certainly eye-catching. But how does it stack up as an actual speaker? Is it all looks and no substance? I'm Gavin Phillips for MakeUseOff.com and this is the Tretitra Trisound 1. Let's dive in to the first thing that you notice about the Trisound 1, its conical design. Inspired by mountain ranges, the Trisound 1's circular base and sloping sides immediately set the speaker apart from the regular black and grey rectangular boxes you find elsewhere. No, the Trisound 1 uses a conical design that immediately sets it apart. The circular tones helping it blend into a room. The Trisound 1 is available in three colours at launch, Snow Peak, Majestic Mountain and Green Hill. Each option looks sublime and the Snow Peak version sent to us for review is the cleanest design of the three. Interestingly, Tretitra have opted for what they're calling a piano paint finish, which gives the exterior of the Trisound 1 a wonderfully smooth and reflective surface. The white finish on the bottom half of the speaker means that the Trisound 1 reflects lights and adds to your lighting setup, drawing your eyes towards the mountain, as it were. You will also note that the speaker features two different textures. Above the polished bottom half is a metal mesh covering the tweeters and speakers. The mesh, manufactured from 304 stainless steel, adds a nice touch to the Trisound 1 and is also vital for airflow into and out of the speaker unit. Now, the Trisound 1 isn't the smallest speaker around. It stands at 400 millimeters, that's just above 15 inches, and its base is 300 millimeters wide, which is between 11 and 12 inches. It's not an absolute behemoth, and it won't take up room like a standing floor speaker would. But it is worth picturing where you'll feature it before purchasing. It also weighs 6 kilos, which is around 13 pounds, which again, it's not heaps, but just make sure you account for that if you're going to put it on a specific ledge, shelf, or a different type of unit. Now, one feature I really like is the low-level LED lighting ring found around the bottom of the unit. It's not an RGB lighting ring, which some users would definitely prefer, but the white light adds a nice delicate edge to the speaker. Another nice touch for the Trisound 1 is the sound control dial at the top of the cone. The metal peak is easy to turn and means you can control the sound with the turn of a dial. There is a small orange light at the top of the Trisound 1 indicating your Bluetooth connection status. While this is an absolutely minute point, matching that light with the LED lighting at the bottom of the speaker would have been a nice touch, but it's far from an actual issue. Please note that the dial is incredibly easy to turn, but maybe keep little hands away from it who might not realize the dial has reached the end of its possible movement. Now, Connectivity comes from Bluetooth 5.1, which isn't the very latest Bluetooth version at the time of review, but it's more than good enough to maintain a proper connection to your devices for audio playback. It'll connect quickly when you attempt to pair, and during playback, there were almost zero glitches or dropouts during my review period, which is always good. The main Bluetooth codec in use here is Aptex HD, so regular Aptex, SBC and AAC are also available. The Trisound 1 documentation doesn't make the use of Aptex entirely clear, but it is mentioned, yet the high resolution Bluetooth codec is definitely in use here, which means you can use the Trisound 1 to stream 24-bit, 96kHz audio 
high-res audio. Of course, you'll also need a high-res audio streaming service like Tidal or Cubuzz um, or a music store locally that uses a high-res audio format like FLAC. Whether or not you can hear the difference between high-res audio and regular audio is another question entirely. You're definitely going to get more quality using Aptex and Aptex HD versus AAC and SBC as both transmit at a higher bitrate than the two standardized Bluetooth codecs. For example, AAC has a maximum bit rate of 264 kilobits per second, where Aptex's main maximum bit rate is 352. That figure rises to 576 with Aptex HD, while the bit depth increases from 16 bit to 24 bit. And when it comes to bit depth, higher is better, and it allows for greater clarity and detail throughout the music, so it is worth using where you can, but as I said, you'll need a, a music streaming service or local files that match the quality. It's good to see Tritichra including Aptex and Aptex HD. The conical speaker isn't an audio file piece of hardware, but the company is definitely taking audio output seriously and wants your music to sound as good as possible through its speaker. Of course, if wireless listening isn't your cup of tea, you can always use the Trisound One 3.5mm input, which is found around the back with the power input. On to the main event. How does the Tritichra Trisound One actually sound? Is the mountainous music player capable of outputting audio as it was meant to sound? First, consider the hardware inside the Trisound One. Tritichra's circular speaker requires audio to emanate from the entire unit rather than focusing on a single direction. As such, the Trisound One includes a multi-speaker design which covers the entire unit, housing two 1.25 inch tweeters and two 2.25 full frequency speakers behind the metal mesh. There's a separate 5.25 inch subwoofer in the wooden base, and the result is a conical circular speaker that, remarkably, sounds exactly the same, no matter where you stand. It's not mind-blowing technology, but it is cool, and it works well, and it makes the Trisound One a useful speaker to have at a party or in the garden if you have people milling around or doing things in, in different places. Tritichra really wanted to push the bass with the Trisound One. You'll find marketing images with cups next to the Trisound one displaying perfect concentric circles rippling outwards, which for me is a little overkill. The base on the Trisound one is decent, but I wouldn't go as far to say as perfection. The multi-speaker combined chamber design of the Trisound one means that at times the all important low end is, is lost as it mixes with the mids and top end all of which use the same metal mesh to escape through and draw air through. The result is that, at times, it feels like the bass is competing with other areas of the EQ for relevance, despite Tritichra's best efforts to make it boom. Then, at other times, it sounds perfectly clear and really does get your table rumbling with low end. You can feel the bass pulsing through your keyboard as you type and the subtleties of dance music and other genres become evident for, for all to hear, which is brilliant. It is a similar story for the top end, though for a different reason. Without being completely balanced with the bass, the top end can sometimes overwhelm the overall sound, but again, not all of the time. Interestingly, the mid-range of the Trisound One is probably the most balanced area of all. When listening to complex arrangements, the spacious mid-range provides ample room for instruments to shine through, allowing most compositions to sound accurate throughout, which again is absolutely what you want from your speaker. Overall, the Trisound One is a good listen. It won't become your go-to for all audio experiences. The sound output isn't what you'd call flat or neutral, but it's not overwhelmingly tuned at either end of the spectrum either. The audio curve for the Trisound 1 does not swoop down from the low end through the mids and rise towards the high end, so most of the time the music you hear is pushing towards a faithful representation. 
Now, on to the final question. Is it time for you to buy a conical mountain range speaker? Tritichra's Trisound 1 is first available for, for purchase through their Indiegogo campaign, which will run from May 17 through June 17, 2022. If you are early, you can pick up the Trisound 1 at the super early bird price of 39999. That's the first 50 orders, or the early bird price of 44999. And that's 200 orders. The final retail price of the Trisound 1 is 799 which means that the Trisound one definitely isn't the cheapest bit of audio hardware to consider. But consider the outright strength of the Trisound one before you bulk at the cost. First, it is a great looking bit of kit. Whether the mountain inspired design speaks to you or not obviously depends on your personal taste and perhaps as to whether you think there is a space in your home for this wonderfully crafted speaker to occupy. It will certainly become a statement piece drawing the eye of visitors and whether that's your cup of tea or not is obviously personal taste second although the idea of 360 degree sound is a little bit of a gimmick it is something Tritichra has had to work with and think about and the multiple speaker and tweeter combination enables the Trisound one to deliver the same sound no matter where you stand now, when you consider that most speakers are directional and you sit in front of them or near them to experience the best sound quality, uh, and many speakers come with recommended listening distances for the best audio quality, that the Trisound One's circular design pushes out audio equally without issue is actually pretty cool. And finally, the Trisound One does sound good. It's not sublime audio quality, but it works well, and you have the high-res audio option. The longer you listen, the more your ears will adjust to the speaker configuration, and the audio quality definitely does improve over time, whether that's burning or, or just ears getting used to it. It's definitely a good sign. So the Trisound One might not be the first speaker you think of when you hit the shops, but its unique features, stylish circular design, and polished piano paint finish definitely make it worth your consideration i've been gavin phillips for makeusoft.com and this is the tritra trisound one speaker if you've liked or enjoyed this review please hit like and subscribe maybe leave a comment if you feel like it and we will see you back here for the next review thanks for watching